case anybody wondered what the Bermuda Triangle looks like, here you go. Look at this view. Currently en route to Bermuda to document Hurricane Igor. So if you had to say one thing to Igor, what would you say? Stay away. <laughs> Stay away. <laughs> Well, here we are. I made it to Bermuda. I'm at the Elbow Beach Resort. And you can see I am right on the water here. This will be where the south side wind comes blowing off the ocean. Here comes a wave. I don't know if you can see how soft the sand is. It's like powder. Look at how deep. There's these cliffs, these big rocks right here. And these waves come up and they crash up against it. beach and the waves are already coming up much higher than yesterday when I was at the same location. This used to be a restaurant where I was eating at and they completely disassembled the roof, the chairs, they put up these like steel walls, the shutters. We're expecting the water, the waves starting tomorrow and the next day, they're going to be huge and they're going to be coming right up here on the beach and crashing right into this building.
And explain to us when the, when there's a hurricane approaching, what happens with the shark oil? Yeah, when when the uh, hurricane is really up, getting close, within I would say 10, 15 hours in advance, it will actually spiral peak. The other means that we use is the mechanical barometer. Right now, the mechanical barometer was pretty high this morning, and if that gives a certain drop in conjunction with the shark oil, you better be prepared.